Hey, what is up everyone? Welcome back to another video. We are here for Sketch Survival episode 32. And uh, yeah, we're going to be doing some progress in this episode. Hopefully making a custom island on in this lake right here. And maybe some other stuff. Who knows? Depends if we have time. Maybe working on the interior of the castle a bit. And we probably have to put something on the island. But uh, yeah, that should be fun. So quite a while ago, I made a video talking about how these are in the wrong spot. No, that, that wasn't what I was talking about. I was talking about how this is off-centered right here. This middle point going back does not line up with this at all. And that I was going to switch it if that video got to 8 likes. And guess what? It's got 8 likes. So the first order of business is me fixing this whole thing. Which, that will be a pain. But I'm going to have to deal with it. And let's get into that right now. In the form of a third person time lapse. And after about 20 minutes, 30 minutes of struggling, I am finally... Oh my goodness, is it wrong? I feel like I had to redo a lot, but eventually I got it done correctly, and I think it was just a pain. <laughs> I don't know why I made the mistake in the first place. But, uh, oh well, we did that. That was fun. But now I want to make a little island in the middle of this lake and then probably have another house on it i don't know what the house is gonna be maybe a fisherman hut or something like that but uh yeah also have i told you guys to subscribe yet yes we take these breaks in almost every single one of my videos and it's an extremely important break because sometimes rarely but sometimes every like 500 minutes every 500 videos not minutes someone will subscribe when i tell them to when the dog shows you the directions at three you're gonna have to subscribe three two one subscribe and hope you have to subscribe if not that's fine and yeah if you guys have already subscribed that's great let's get into a third person time lapse though where we build up a little mountain did i actually just say mountain i meant to say a island Okay, so I've built the island, and I think we it does need a bit more work, and for more work, I'm probably just going to add, like, a building and stuff, and then maybe terraform around it, like, inside the ocean on the edges here, like, with some riverside terraforming techniques that I used, and, yeah, I think that this will eventually come together a little bit more. Maybe we could have had the island be a little bit bigger. I didn't really know what I wanted to do with it, but, yeah. I think it definitely looks pretty good for an island. I mean, like, what else can you do with an island, to be honest? Hmm. I think it's looking pretty nice. I just added a little building and a little dock here. And uh, I haven't really done anything to the building at the moment yet. And I haven't really done much more terraforming around it. But I just added a little building to see what a little building would look like on here. And I definitely really like it, but I think it can use like a custom tree right here and then a little bone wheeling a little path going down to the dock and maybe a boat in the future but at the moment we don't have a boat yet but i definitely think it has potential for a lot more good stuff on this building which i definitely really like the building it's definitely looking very nice i added a little bit of details already but not too many details that we can tell but yeah i'm gonna add a bunch of finishing touches and i'll be back after i finish that i just wanted to show you guys a little progress update on what i have done with the island 
And about 20 minutes later, we have gotten a little bit more done. And I added a little barge here, uh, inspired by Green's barge from Hermitcraft. So it can also connect with like these trap doors over to the dock, so you can actually get on and off pretty easily, which I think I like a lot. And then I added a custom tree around here, some grass, bone meal did a little bit, some sugar cane, some leaves, and also did a bit on the interior, not very much. I added like the floors and stuff, but I didn't really have time to do the interior yet. So I'm probably going to do that now. And yeah, I definitely like how this small build is turning out though. And I can't believe we actually changed this or fixed the whole castle. That was like so annoying. But eventually we did get that done. And yeah, I'm definitely liking how this build is turning out. And... It's one of my favorite build projects so far, actually, to be honest. I really like how it's such a small little project, but then you get so much detail to do, like you get to experiment with different things with it, and I definitely like that. Let's actually take a break from this build and go over to the Sketch Survival Museum to add the addition of this episode. And the comment of the episode goes to Robo. Maybe for season two, you could do a hardcore survival world and uh the reason why i chose that comment is because i wanted to bring something up to you guys i'm actually doing a stream series at the moment called surviving 100 days in minecraft hardcore with friends or something like that and we've currently at the time of recording we have done about 10 days but we should be continuing that soon Hopefully so you guys subscribe to the channel if you guys want that and I just wanted to mention that really quickly But we can get on into the interior and then we're probably gonna end the episode after the interior Because it's been quite a long one Or there's been a lot of progress sort of that's what I meant Before we get on into the interior we should probably do a few chores of the episode Such as harvesting crops at our new build and if you guys haven't seen the process of this amazing little house on the actually custom hill that we have, uh, you guys should definitely go check that out. I think it's a really cool few episodes, and I definitely like them a lot, so I definitely recommend going back to watch those ones. Maybe not, if you're new to the series, maybe not going back to the first few episodes, because they're literally the stupidest episodes and the stupidest videos on my channel. Like, they're so bad. Because, like, I was just starting off with YouTube and I had no idea what I was doing at that point in time. So those ones are pretty bad. But these ones, the ones where we build this, they're not that bad. And I definitely would recommend going to watch them. Because they were pretty good, actually, in my opinion. And we did really nice building techniques. And you guys probably can learn a bit of building techniques if you guys go watch that. And I would definitely recommend it. Just a little bit of self-promo there. And probably gonna self-promote my Instagram because I post a lot on there. I have been less active, uh, but I'm probably gonna be active again on there soon again. I've been po I, I was posting every day for a little bit and then I ran out of posts. So I'm probably gonna get more posts for that and stuff like that. But yeah, definitely go check out my Instagram. It's linked down below as always. And yeah, I just wanted to mention that. Let's do a small first person time lapse where I actually get these crops.
Now that you've seen that time lapse, let's get into the interior of the build. A little bit of progress later, and we've done the interior. Look, there's a painting. Uh, but I decided that I wanted to put a lot of paintings in this house because maybe the person that lives here likes art a lot or something. So I put like a painting here, a painting here, and then we have the little kitchen area with some barrels up top, a few cookbooks behind some, I don't know, pan I don't know actually. We have a crafting table, a smoker there. Absolutely nothing in any of these, by the way, if you're wondering. These are just purely for design. And then when you go upstairs, lots and lots of paintings, a chest, a bed, some carpets, and a little flower. And I definitely love how this one came out. It turned out pretty nice. These bookshelves were so hard to get, but I really wanted them. Uh, they weren't that hard. They are just a little annoying because I barely have any more sugar cane left. But we had enough cows for that. But yeah, that is basically it for today's video. We did a whole a whole island of stuff and a whole building, as you can see. And I think it turned out really, really nice. Uh, and I added more detail into the terraforming for the island. And I definitely like it. It looks pretty nice. And I definitely want to do small projects like this around this town. I definitely want this town to keep being built and it i just wanted to continue throughout the future episodes i don't want it to end and uh yeah i really really hope you guys did enjoy this episode though if you guys did make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already uh as all minecraft youtubers say only a small percentage of the people who watch my videos are actually subscribed so if you're a part of that big percentage that's not subscribed subscribe you won't regret it. And if you do, you can always unsubscribe. It's free. All that good stuff. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Goodbye. Also, I got this email. I don't... I didn't know I had it, but I have it. And I really like it, I think. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that. Thank you guys for watching. Bye-bye.